Yellowstone Volcano. How supervolcano was discovered leaking by USGS. Yellowstone Volcano scientists discovered the supervolcano was releasing around 60 tons of helium from underground stores each year. The Yellowstone caldera gets its chilling label as a supervolcano due to its ability to inflict devastation on a global level. Hiding below the states of Wyoming, Montana and Idaho, the volcano is constantly monitored by the USGS, United States Geological Survey, for signs that a super eruption is on its way. However, researchers were stunned in 2014 when their study showed it was leaking hundreds, possibly thousands more gas than expected, lead scientists Jacob Lowenstern at the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory said, we had sort of an aha moment where we realized, well, that there's a lot of crustal helium coming out of Yellowstone, far more than we would have predicted. When uranium and thorium decay, they produce helium, or in this case the isotope helium-4. The gas is gurgling up from a store that's been trapped in the Earth's core for up to 2 million years. Study co-author Bill Evans explained that 2 million years might seem like a really, really long time to people, but in the geologic time scale, the volcanism is a recent phenomenon. The helium was initially released when a hotspot of collected magma fought its way to the Earth's surface and caused a series of volcanic eruptions, the most recent of which occurred 640,000 years ago. Dr. Evans added, Think of it this way, you have these old crustal rocks just sitting around for hundreds of millions, perhaps billions of years. They have this boring little existence, and then suddenly somebody puts the heat on under them and they start giving up all their long-held secrets. However, this doesn't mean Yellowstone is any closer to erupting. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to us on YouTube. If you like donate to us visit home on the page PayPal.